Hey what's going on everybody, it's KJ Chaos and in this video I'm going to show you guys how to get Poseidon's Trident and Assassin's Creed Odyssey. So the only downside of getting this weapon is that it is level 41 and it will take you a little while to actually get to that level to actually be able to use it. But whenever you actually do, you're going to be you're gonna be glad that you actually spent the time to level up to actually use this weapon. Um, if you guys are wondering where it's at, it's on a little small island above Asmos um, at the far right side of the map. It's kind of like in the middle, kind of more up than it is uh, near the middle. But it's right here above this. If you guys have actually been to Athens, um, it's literally just right to the right of it. So it's easy um, to not to miss and to actually get to. Just make sure you steer clear of the enemy ships in the area because they are really high leveled and they will kill you very easily so don't attempt it. Um, if you guys want, I'm going to show you guys how I was able to sneak up on this because there are lions here or tigers that are actually well, lions that are of level 41 so they literally will one hit you if you are not level 41. So make sure you guys follow what I do to get there safely and to be able to actually get this trident without having to fight these things. Unless you're level 41 then go ahead and fight them. But if you're not, um, just follow what I do to sneak past them. So the actual chest you want to be looking for is the one right here as you can see. It's the one that looks more expensive. There are two here, but it's the one that actually has the kind of line uh, on the top of it and actually looks like it's made of something other than just actual wood. So what you want to do is wait for one the, the actual alpha line, which is a white one, to actually move away. And the other two are just like come in and just lay down and go to sleep. Just use the bushes to your advantage, come over here and hop up on this and just open up the box and take it and then run away, jump to the water and go back to your actual ship so you can open it up and hey, look at your actual uh, trident that you actually stole from these stupid lions that have no or t uh, yeah, lions that have no idea that you uh, just stole, stole it from them while they were taking their cat nap. So what you're going to do is, what I did anyways, was get out of there so just in case they woke up or seen me running that uh, they wouldn't kill me because it's kind of upsetting if you get up to it and you take it and then a lion just comes up and just kills you and just one hits you because you're not the correct level. But anyways, when you get up here to your ship or whatever you want to, you feel comfortable to actually go to to look at, and which in my opinion is an awesome looking spear, and also one of the perks of this guy is that you can breathe underwater when you have it equipped. Uh, I'm pretty sure it's going to be equipped, not if you just have an inventory, which is all absolutely awesome that it just really just makes sense, the whole Poseidon's trident thing, that he's the god of the sea, or uh, ocean, or breeze, whatever you want to call it. But anyways, it really t makes total sense that you can actually breathe underwater with this thing. That's really awesome. It does 1,863 uh, damage, uh, which is, uh, I guess, typical for a 41 weapon, but it does uh, come with actually a pretty cool actual other perks. You have like 15% per uh, more warrior damage, 25% more crit damage damage it does an all-around awesome looking spear I also love the way that it looks it literally looks really awesome I know there's another type of uh, Poseidon trident out there but it's not the actual one like this one this is actually his actually has the perk to breathe underwater you can see there how it looks it looks absolutely awesome and I cannot wait until level 41 to actually equip this and actually be able to use it on enemies and it's also gonna be very useful if you're underwater and you're searching for loot and stuff that's you have to stand underwater for a certain, of, a certain period amount of time and you can just literally just equip this and just literally have unlimited health, or well not health, but unlimited actual breath so you don't have to ever breathe underwater so you can just stay there as long as you want and just take in all the uh, glory of the ocean, get all those chests and then kill sharks, whatever you want to do. It's really up to you what you want to do with this thing but yeah guys this is kind of like a secret little weapon that was hidden uh, if anybody's ever found it yet literally on a small little island as you see here that's literally you can just go right past me like hey that's this little island nothing's gonna be there so this pretty much tells me that there's other type of weapons uh, that are related to gods in this game which I cannot wait to actually find and see for myself of uh, what their actual perks will be because this one you can breathe underwater if you have it equipped so that I find really awesome anyways guys that is pretty much it for this video if you're new to my channel please hit the subscribe button it really helps me out a lot if you like this video hit that like button and notification button at the top of this at the top so you guys are notified as soon as my new videos come live anyways guys that is it for this video and i will see you guys next time